Once you're on the upload new media page, all you have to do is click on select files right here and then go to your folder where you save the zip file. So I'm in my downloads folder and the folder that I want to open up is called web tutorial files. And once I'm in this folder, I can select these images one by one to upload them or I can just select everything all at once. So that's what I'll do. I'll just scroll down and select all of these images and then I'll just deselect the child theme right here because we don't have to upload that. And once you're ready, go ahead and click choose right here. And now you can see in this list, all of your images getting uploaded. So you can upload everything right now, or what you can do is come back here and upload some new images later, or you can upload images whenever you create pages and posts. So I'll show you how to do that also. So let's let all of these images upload really quickly. And once they're done, we're gonna move on to the next step, which is going to be creating the homepage for our WordPress website. So all of your images should be uploaded now. And if we scroll down, you shouldn't see any errors. And if you wanna edit any of these images, you can click on the edit link right here. Or what you can do is go back up to the top over here to the media tab. And you can see all of your images if you click on the library link right here. So let's click on that. Once you're on the media library page, you should see all of the images that we just uploaded right here. And if you ever want to edit or delete one of these images, just click on the image and you'll see some options right here. Or what you can do is click on the edit image button right here and you'll get this pop up and you can rotate or crop this image or you can change the size of the image right here. So I'll let you play around with this on your own if you want. I just want to make you aware of this option. So what I'm going to do is close out of this. And now we have all of our demo content that we need for our WordPress website. And if you ever want to upload some additional images, you can come to your media library and click on add new right here, or go to the media tab and click on add new right here. Okay. So I'll also show you how to upload images when we create different pages and posts also. So I'll show you that as we go through this video tutorial.